Hello, I'm Clive Tilsey. I've got Andy Townsend with me for this one. Good to have you with us. It could be a memorable match. It's Russia and Argentina. Argentina can be the most beautiful team in the world. They can be the most ugly team in the world. Is that their greatest quality, that they don't mind how they do it? Yeah, I think that's, that's a good point. I think with, with the Argentinian team, you know that uh, they have a lot, of, a lot of key individuals, a lot of very talented players. Messi walks into any team anywhere in the world. But I think if it does get a little bit niggly, if it is tight, if it is tense, if it is nasty, they look after themselves, they know how to mix it with the very best. Hey, they're a very capable team in more ways than one. Argentina kick off the first half, a game that's really got everyone talking. Gonzalo Higuain. Returns it to him. Attack broken up. Well read that, saw the pass quicker than the man it was meant for. Look at Argentina here. Aguero! Some say he dived across to keep it out. Thank you very much, says the goalkeeper. Zagoev. Great tackle there. Argentina looking to threaten. Free kick given, not a yellow card offence, not at this early stage anyway. Really poor effort. Should have kept possession of the ball. Zagoev. Here's Angel Di Maria. Argentina on the attack. Just going to creep in for a moment. Well, the goalkeeper looks cool, but he knows that was very, very close. Shenikov. Is it the full width of the pitch? Who's on the end of this? Ball played in. Well defended. Aguero. Higuain. Really asking some questions at the moment. Defender read that well. They were getting pushed back there. Really good interception there. Got to make better use of the ball than that. Look at Argentina here. Throw-in can be as good as a corner or a free kick in the right hands. Oh, 
Banega. Vital interception there. There was danger developing. Unable to keep hold of the ball. Shakoev. Messi's ball intercepted. Play it wide, looking to stretch their opponents. Managed to get a foot on the ball and win it. Russia have men forward. Argentina have the ball, advantage play. They stood firm. Samedov. What a foot to the ball. It's a real chance! Block the shot. Zagoev. Shakoev. Plenty of players committed to this attack. Referee's given the throw to Russia. Don't know what he was thinking about with that throw in. They've committed men forward here. Could be dangerous. Dangerous cross. Defenders there, though. Oh! And there's the opening goal! We can see a replay here, and they may show us more. Leno Messi. The Argentine manager will be preparing his half-time words. This is a game still in the balance. Got the ball. Zagoev. Here come Russia. Couldn't get past him. Good cross there, cleared away by the defender. Did well to cut that out, good interception. The players are about to learn the uh, time for injuries and stoppages now. Russia have men forward. Looks a good one. The cross is much too close to the goalkeeper. Referee brings the first half to an end. It's 1-0. Russia start the second period, hoping the break hasn't broken their rhythm. Caught in possession. Kept his eye on the ball. Shakoev. Intercepted well, taking the pressure off his defence. Little back heel. Hits for a goal! Good save there, managed to hold on. Banega. Defence held. Argentina looking to threaten. Di Maria! Great diving save by the keeper, good stop. It'll be an Argentinian corner. Aguero! Oh yes, it's there! Just slotted it in there, no need for great power when you've got great accuracy. Fine goal that. He is good with his head. They surely knew that about him before the game. Excellent control with his head, and that's a top-class finish. Oh. 
So the score's level at one each now then. Confident in possession. Here come Russia. Ball is out, it'll be a throw into Russia. Samadov. Di Maria. Aguero. It was a, a foul on the Argentinian player, free kick. Two goals in no time. You know, come on, this isn't a kid's game now. We've got to start waking up and smelling the danger when it's there. They know exactly what's coming when he places the ball for a free kick, but doing anything to stop him is another matter altogether. Clive, when he stood over the ball, I thought, hey, I fancy him here, he's got a big opportunity, and he's popped that in the back of the net. That goal makes it 2-1 here. Samidov. Zagoev. It's a nice idea. Is it a good cross? Brilliant save. There are players on the field who can really get some distance on these. He's throwing it straight back to them. Is Angel Di Maria. Gonzalo Higuain. Can't quite get past him. That's a really good ball. Oh! He scored! It's all square now! And nobody saw that coming. The favourites lead wiped out by a shock equaliser. They didn't put that in the script, Clive, before the game. That's, uh, that's made all the difference here. that puts Russia back on terms. This could go either way. Argentina on the attack. Bit of a tangle there. Still 20 minutes to go, enough time for all kinds of things to happen. Throwing has been given Russia's way. Shenikov. Denisov. Denisov. We're all on the same wavelength here. Genuine chance. Oh, if only he could have hit the target. They might have had the edge in this game. Oh, he got ahead of himself there, Clive. He's seeing that nestling in the back of the net. He's already run into the crowd before he struck it. Just a quarter of an hour left on the clock now, a crucial period. Look at Argentina here. Time the challenge well. Di Maria, intended for Aguero. Instant reactions. Beat him all ends up there. Oh! Yes, it's in! From time to time, you see a goal that just takes the breath away. That was a simply magnificent effort. You can hit a shot as powerfully as you like, but when you place it like that, it doesn't matter how hard you hit yeah, it. Don't point any fingers at the goalkeeper here. That's right up in the top corner. You can't get them.
This is a good game. It's now three goals to two. Samidov. Russia have men forward. Don't know what was said in the Argentine dressing room at half time, but it's done the trick, hasn't it? Keeping the ball here. He's got away from his marker. Aguero! And he scored! It's a goal that gives them real breathing space. They'll take some beating now. Didn't panic, didn't rush. Scored in his own good time, in his own sweet way. He's got some style, this guy. No real power there, Clive, but it was all about a, a quality, cultured finish. That really is a beautiful strike. The game was always likely to produce goals. So it's four goals to two. That's a searching ball. Here come Russia. Couldn't get through. Now Sergio Aguero. Denisov. Otamendi got to it. Argentina looking to threaten. Let it get away from him. Now, how much added time is there going to be? The board is up. Yeah, I thought so. Four minutes. Gonzalo Higuain. Aguero! Oh, excellent goalkeeping. Denisov. Russia have men forward. Battled well. Can they get to it? Trying a header. Russia forced a corner. There's the final whistle. And as the players shake hands, the uh, final scoreline here is 4-2. They've been beaten here. It's a poor result. Not a good performance, and I'm afraid it was always going to end up with a defeat.
game with no imagination Feel them on my own, never been a clone Not much to do and all my mates are Thank you for joining us. Clive Tilsley here. Andy Townsend's my co-commentator for this one. We're ready to go. Two useful teams, France versus Italy. Barclay France, Prince's Park, houses fewer than 50,000 fans, but it's a, an old traditional stadium full of history and style. Yes, perhaps not as uh, modern as the Stade de France, Clive, but uh, as you say, lots of history, and, and I think that's what makes it a special stadium. This has the look of a, a close match to me, Andy. I am well and truly on the fence today, Mr Tilsley. I can't separate these two. Not since 1998 of France really realised their potential on the world stage, but that was some team. Who were the players that you admired most in that World Cup winning team? They were incredible. I think when you looked at, at Desai, at Lillian Turam, of course Zidane, and, and we saw the, 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 you know, the emergence then of people like Patrick Vieira, they had some just some incredible players. And, uh, and, and I think at that time would absolutely dominant in world football. Away, France kick off. France on the attack. Well, he's got away from his marker. Oh! A great finish. Terrific finish. Keeper had no chance. Couldn't get down to it. That's the sort of football we all want to see, Clark. That really is top quality. And once he gets in that one-on-one -on -one scenario, you just know he's not going to miss. They don't save those when a player catches hold of a volley like that. He just flies past the keeper before he knows it. Picture goal. Yeah, great technique, Clark. Goalkeeper, no chance with that volley. this but France are in front can driver couldn't retain possession Italy coming for there may be something on here Magriella. great save that's very good goalkeeping didn't protect the ball well enough had it lost it Pogba What about that? Defender reacted quicker. Real chance! Buffon makes no mistake. Italy have the ball. One or two possibilities here. They've got men up in numbers here. Can they get to it? Searching cross. Defender deals with it. Pogba. Pass intercepted. Can he take the charge? Defence stayed firm. Coman. Ben Arthur. The French looking dangerous. It's there to be hit. So close. Just needs to become a bit more accurate from there. Marchisio couldn't keep hold of the ball. 
Marquisio's pass picked off. France looking to threaten. You saw that coming. Would that... He's had a go! Luigi Buffon is there. Italy on the attack. What can they come up with here? Very quick to cut the ball out. Oh, now here's danger. Attack fizzles out. It's a goal kick. Marchisio. Can Italy make something of this? Got to look after the ball better than that. Coman. He's a one-man team at the moment. Couldn't force an opening. Lost the ball. He's given the foul, not sure if he'll book him for that or not. Got the ball back. Can't afford to lose the ball like that. And that is in the keeper's hands now. Let it get away from him. Italy have men forward. Would it find a man? Crossed it to the danger area. Solid defending. Togba saw the danger, snuffed it out, intercepted well. Happy to keep the ball. Got the ball back out wide. Attack comes to nothing. They've got to be careful not to get caught on the break here. Oh, that is frustrating. I thought there was something in that, but now they have to get back and get their shape. France coming forward. There may be something on here. Possibilities here. A gentle goal. Oh, great athleticism from the keeper. A goal to the good, and they've got a corner. Good position. Well, you know, he's always prepared to have a go. Ooh, that was a good hit, Clive. A relieved man between the sticks there. They're not holding back here, pouring men forward. Can they get to it? Good delivery. Defender had to react. Referee brings the first half to an end. It's 1-0. Too many players just weren't at the races in the opening. It's Italy who restart, not that they really got started in that first half. They weren't falling for that one. Nice to get a foot on the ball and win it. France have the ball, one or two possibilities here. France do make the ball do the work, good precise passing. It's a goal kick, I think. Yes, thought so.
can't afford to take a risk with him. You need to get him off and give him some proper attention. So a substitution is being made. Giovinco comfortably intercepted. Poor pass, really. Kante. France can do something here. Oh, oh that's some stop. Buffon continues to deny Clive and it's giving the Italians a chance. Read that. Jack Bailey! Great work from the goalkeeper. When you're worth over £35 million, pounds, Clive, you're expected to keep your team in it. And Buffon is certainly doing that. Can he pick out the right pass? They stood firm. Ben Arthur. Got the ball. Marquisio. Patient build-up. Defender was a beaten man there. Off the post! Oh, missed by fractions! Cannot afford to keep squandering chances like that, Clyde. They should have gone level there. France on the attack. What can they come up with here? Death touch. He's found some room. Last touch came off an opponent. It is a French corner. Could be dangerous. Cross is comfortably collected by Buffon. Giovinco. Italy looking to create something. Will he find a man? Hugo Lloris clears his lines. Important interception, relieve the pressure. We're into the final quarter now, just 20 more minutes. Clever little ball inside. Good effort! Not in the way of it. Dembele. In senior. Italy coming for there may be something on here. How to play for a goal kick. We've reached a critical stage now, just a quarter of an hour to go. Ref Referee has given the free kick. Is that it or will he book him? Candreva. Italy have the ball. One or two possibilities here. Got well, a bit carried away there. Didn't look. Their place a bit untidy at times. It is, and it's careless, isn't it? Because they're in a good position there. Shivinko! Hugo Lloris makes the save. Read the situation, didn't he? Wasn't the best of passes. Marchisio. Italy on the attack. Foul.
good ball in, needy defending there. He's been robbed. That's a good ball. Opening here. Oh, excellent goalkeeping. Well, that's another brilliant save. We've seen plenty from him today, Clive, but uh, he's got to concentrate now in these closing minutes to see out this match and keep a clean sheet. Got it clear. Free kick, but they'll have to get on with it. The yellow card comes out, they can complain all they like. He does have these moments when he goes flying into these challenges and invariably it ends up with him getting a yellow card. Cross was a good one. Defender gets it away. What a difference it would make if France could somehow just double their lead. A one goal advantage never seems enough. Got caught with it. The French looking dangerous. Conte. Look at this, they've not picked him up. And the goalkeeper will take those all day long. Nicely played. here and a different view Substitution coming up, not what the manager wanted to make. It's out of necessity because of uh, injury. Pity, really. It's all a bit one-sided. That makes it 2-0. Loses the ball. France looking to threaten. was a victory in the end by two goals to nil. Well, enjoy this victory, all right. The celebrations will be long and loud after this result. No better feeling than beating your fiercest rivals. So much said about this match before the game, but I think they deserved it. I don't think they can have any complaints. France on the attack. He's gone away from his marker. Oh! <laughs> Possibilities here. A gentle goal. Oh, great athleticism from the keeper. France could do something here. Oh, oh, that's some stop.
Read that. Jack Bailey. Great work for the goalkeeper. He's been robbed. That's a good ball. Opening here. Oh, excellent goalkeeping. France on the attack. He's gone away from his marker. Oh! oh! Great finish! Terrific finish. Keeper had no chance. Couldn't get down to it. That's the sort of football you all want to see, Kai. That really is top quality. And once he gets in that one on one scenario, you just know he's not going to.